<laughs> Can you go say hi to Leo? Okay, y'all, I'm sitting in my car right now. Um, it is Sunday. It's around 1.30. Mabry is napping, and <laughs> it's so bright. But um, it's actually really nice out. I'm going to look what the temperature is. But anyways, what was I going to say? I need to clean out my car. It's 52. Dang, that's nice. Okay, I'm going to clean out my car today. I was going to wait until the next nice day or whatever. And it's 52. I'm going to clean out my car. I'll probably try to take Mary to the park. But anyways, so I was like, I'll just film in my car because I've been trying to film this last part of my video for so long. And I'm always, like, distracted. And so I was like, I'm just going to go out to my car. Like, I don't know if that's weird, but hey, it's going to get the job done. Um, I have some coffee. I used my, um, like, that creamer that I showed y'all. I actually have a lot, a lot of drinks. I have this one. It's the violet drink. Yeah, because they were out of the pink drink, and then I just have a water. So now that I just hate, now that I just took three drinks. So, anyways, um, I was just gonna talk to you all. So this is just gonna be like a little um, car chat, I guess. Um, I say um so much. Anyways, I obviously do not, like I hardly have like any makeup at all. I think I just have like some powder on because it was like super rainy and gloomy this morning and it still kind of is. I mean, it's brightening up or whatever and it's definitely nicer, but today the most I'm going to do is clean out my car and I mean, just kind of clean up the house some. Like I'm not planning to leave again. Um, every morning I've been waking up super like congested and like it's just been so bad and so I'm actually going to excuse me I'm gonna start on well I started Young Living a while ago actually but um, then I kind of just stopped it's very it can be very pricey but I I'm, I'm at the point where you know like as a mother I think it will be worth it to kind of invest in my family's health you know in natural and just healthy um, like items or whatever and like I said I was using that one oil for Mavery for a while and then we ran out so I think we're gonna order that again and see if it will still help her but I think I'm going to start that again <clears throat> and I'm still trying to figure out um, there's a couple ladies that I might like register under or whatever because 
I was registered under someone, but I mean, they're just no longer like useful or whatever. And my registration, um, like expired because it was like already over a year or whatever since I last used it. But anyway, so in the beginning of this video, you'll see how I got like the Keurig latte maker or whatever. So I was going to talk to y'all about that. So once again, um, I'm not sure how much I've said before my video cut me off or whatever, but, and this is a few days later, obviously. However, so I was looking at like the Nespresso or whatever, a lot of influencers and bloggers or whatever have it. And I've been looking at that one for a while. <clears throat> I was actually going to purchase it. I went into two different stores, but neither of them had it. And so then I just, I was at Walmart looking for it and I was like, I'm going to try out this Keurig latte maker or whatever because the main thing I wanted to was the frother or whatever like the milk frother and so I picked up the Keurig it was like a hundred dollars cheaper than the Nespresso or whatever and I was like I mean if it does like the same thing and I feel like there are so many different Keurig pods or whatever you can choose from um the ones I have now I will admit I haven't used it as much lately because the pods or whatever I have now make it very very sweet like I don't really like to taste the coffee, but they're like too sweet. Like it's just like, it's just like holy moly. Like, you know, like you need like a little, like a little hint of coffee, but so I need to get some new Keurig pods. However, <clears throat> I mean, honestly, it's been like, it's been great. And I was really proud of myself because sometimes, I mean, I've waited to purchase the Nespresso for like a year. Like I've been thinking about it and I was like, do I even like coffee enough to spend $180 or whatever? So I was really proud of myself to kind of, you know, go with the cheaper option instead of having something that everyone else had or whatever, you know, because that can be a very easy trap to fall under at times. So <clears throat> if you're in the market for like a, one of the like fancy coffee machines or whatever, I would definitely check out the Keurig um, latte maker. Once again, I got mine at Walmart for like $89, I believe. And it comes with the frother or whatever, but I'm sure you will see it in plenty of like the beginning of my videos or whatever, which <clears throat> I feel like I'm not even gonna, I don't know. Like I don't really want to touch up because I feel like I always say in here like I'm going to post more like whatever and then stuff comes up. But, um, so a little like updates, I guess I stopped working for my Instagram, like influence or whatever, like I stopped that job. Um, it was a very tough decision for me too because I don't, I don't know. Like, you know, it's just very hard for me. I put in a lot of thought before like I stop something and it's, it's very difficult for me because I, I'm like a very emotional person. So I feel like everything. So like, I don't know. I just felt bad stopping, whatever, but I was like, no, <clears throat> you know, I have to put myself first and um like I usually did the work like I would like sometimes not get done until midnight and it was like so great but um I stopped it because I don't know I'm just trying to focus on myself and my family and I've been trying to go to bed you know at, like eight or nine <clears throat> like ten at the latest that way um you know I just have to focus on myself or whatever however I did um, it was kind of like an interview slash meetup, but I, um, met up about a possible job opportunity. Mm, when was it? I think Thursday or a couple days ago. Yeah. And so I'll find out about that next week. So you could say some prayers or whatever. I mean, obviously if I don't get it, it's not the right thing for me at the time. However, I could use some prayers for, you know, like guidance and if it's meant to be that I'll get the job or whatever. If it's not, that more opportunity will come along. So that's a little update. Um, I will be starting school again. I had to file an appeal to go back to the school that I was going to because I didn't complete like some classes or whatever because <coughs> um, just life, you know. And so I had to submit an appeal and I got approved. So now I'm waiting for some emails and then I have to register for classes. And so I think I'll be starting in um, beginning of March, I believe. And I'm going back for a psychology. I still don't know the exact, um, 
I don't really know yet. I'm in between two things. So I'm wanting to be a, like a family psychologist or whatever, or a um, family and juvenile like lawyer eventually, but I don't know. Cause it will be my dream to obviously um, open up like my own, like practice one day and have my own business. Like regardless of whether I'm a psychologist or a lawyer, I don't know, but needless to say, um, you honestly like, and sometimes I felt like embarrassed to tell people what I was going for because I felt they would like judge me or be like, yeah, like, okay, we'll see if that actually happens. And so it's a lot of, um, it can be a lot of pressure. So I guess, um, I don't know, like if you don't want to tell people, then don't feel the need to, you like just have to do what is best for you. But also don't let people's opinions obviously stop you and their opinions also shouldn't be the only reason that you know you you go to law school or something because then you're going to be like that's like a long eight to ten years or whatever of doing something because of other people's opinions and you might not you know get through it if that's all but i don't know it's like um a lot but i want to do it for myself because i feel like i don't know like I don't want someone like other people's opinions to stop my dreams and I'm like very passionate about helping others and you know just like all of that or whatever I'm very open about like stuff that I've gone through go through that's just I don't know something that I'm very passionate about and I'm very open about that like I'll talk to you and tell you like you know if I feel like it's gonna help you so I don't know I'm very excited to see where it goes though but I'm also kind of terrified to go back to school because it is, you know, it's a lot, but I'd rather um, work my way through it now when my daughter is so small than when she's like five and she's like noticing that I'm like, you know, but I'm going to try to like, you know, like wake up in the mornings, do it before she wakes up and when she goes to bed because I don't want it, oh, it just got so bright because I don't want it to, to take away like from time with her, you know, because at the end of the day, like the most important thing in my life is her and being a mom so you know but anyways um I, I got off topic when I was talking about how like I'll come on here and be like I'm gonna film more like whatever and so I don't want to say that in this video because I say that in like every video and I'm I'm sure y'all are over it I'm over it <laughs> no but um I honestly am just working on putting out like <coughs> excuse me good lord I'm working out on I'm working on putting out good, um, you know, like good content. So I don't want to tell you all that I'm going to post these days and then put out a video that I think is like a three or something when I could have taken like a week longer or a couple days longer and then put out like a good, like informational video or like a good video, you know, like hopefully that makes sense. So I'm, I'm not putting a time limit or I'm not going to say I'm posting these days. I'm going to post and just know that when I do post that like I, I don't know, like it was meaningful. It was from the heart and it wasn't like forced, you know, so hopefully that makes sense. But, um, I don't know. I'm trying. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm just trying to find balance, you know, cause that is, that is huge. I've been setting, um, time limits like on my social media and I've still been going to burn, however my membership is up like next weekend. I have like a week left, which is very sad because now I have to decide what I'm going to do and if I'm going to keep going and put my monthly budget towards that or kind of what I'm going to do, but I don't know. It has been amazing, I will say that. It's just like I don't ever want to go, but then when I go, it's like I feel like 20 times better. I feel so empowered and it's great, okay? It's great. <coughs> Oh my goodness. I think I'm getting sick. In case you couldn't tell. <clears throat> but also, um, what was I going to say? My breastfeeding video. Holy moly, y'all. I have been saying that I'm going to do that for like ever. Which is another thing. Like I need to start, you know, prioritizing and setting aside time. Like for sure. But, um, so anyways, that will be coming. It will be coming soon. Um, I'm going to make a goal to have it up sometime this week for sure okay okay I'm just gonna put that energy out there I'm going to have it up soon because my baby turned 18 months yesterday 
that's insane she's literally six months away from being two that is just crazy but i'm gonna get it posted okay within the next week and um she still breastfeeds we're, we're still going strong she breastfeeds a lot but i'm not gonna go into depth because i'll obviously save it for the video but yeah she breastfeeds a lot <laughs> 18 months in okay we'll talk more in that specific video but <clears throat> anyways I don't know if I have anything else to say. Um, I need to majorly clean out my car. I told y'all that I was gonna show you that hair mask that I used, and then I left it in my car. It was like on my floor mat up here, right? And I, I set like my purse down or something, and I, um, and it squirted all over my purse, and we were like walking into Old Navy, and all of a sudden I'm like, what is on my arm? Like it was just like purple, and it was all over my purse. And yeah, needless to say, my hair dye went all over my purse all over my converse so r.i.p to those babies it got all over my white tennis shoes so i <clears throat> um think so i was in the market for new shoes anyways because mine were super bad like when i worked out they hurt my feet so bad but anyways needless to say i cannot show you all right now however it is like a purple it's in like a purple little packet i'll try to link it below or like write the name below but I also picked up some of this at Ulta. I know a lot of people hear about this or like a lot of people talk about this. The Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. Um, I love it. But then I stopped using it. Um, they have a lot too. Like I used the purple one for a while. Like it was like the lavender and whatnot. But anyways, um, yeah, so I'm going to clean out my car. Because ever since we got back from Georgia, it is a hot mess. And people who saw my car, they would not actually believe me. But, like, I'm actually, like, a major clean freak. Like, this has been giving me, like, ah, for so long. Like, I don't like messy things. I have, like, OCD. Like, so this is crazy. <clears throat> um, yeah, I don't even want to show you all, honestly. And if you're a mom, you know. Like, my daughter's car seat is, oh, it is insane. I'm just, like what 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 it's it's bad like my husband says she has like a whole pantry in there <laughs> literally so anyways i'm gonna clean out it's 1 i'm gonna clean out the car and then i'm going to go inside put on some full house and get this video uploaded for y'all i promise so i hope y'all have a great rest of your sunday and then a great week and it's so bright and i'm sorry this took me so long but i will hopefully see you all the beginning of this week with my breastfeeding video. So, thank you.